What? What the hell? Can I get that bottom note, please? I don't know where this... Oh, okay. Yeah. That goes there. And this one goes there. Stacking the pieces might be a good idea. If only I had a way to see through them somehow. You do. No? Martini? Wait! Can hold them up to the light. We're gonna use your room. It's a good idea, but the light isn't bright enough. Look! What do you think of these notes I found? Where did you find these? The weird radio signal led me to them. Really? They seem to be parts of a map, but it seems incomplete. I suggest you try to find the missing pieces. I don't think there are any more. In that case, I'm fresh out of ideas. Where can I get more light? My room, maybe? How do I turn on my lamp? I need a brighter light. Where am I gonna get this light from? Maybe there's one in cabin too? Hmm. The portal. No? Come on. That was brilliant. Look who's stuck in the portal. Aha! So how to make things easier? Boom! The red lines seem to converge right outside of cabin two. I wonder what's there. Huh? <gasps> It's the mermaid. The lines on the map converge right about here. There must be something special about this statue. I'd better examine it carefully. Examine the tail. I can't find anything remarkable about it. Look behind it. There's nothing behind it. Examine the body. It seems hollow. Oh. Examine the arms. Pretty unremarkable. There's two eyes and a mouth. Put your finger in the mouth. The tongue yields a little when I press it. A hidden compartment opened up on the underside of the statue. Something fell out. What is that? Personnel files. Whoa. Victor 67, missing. Victor 71, missing. Victor 18, 97. What? Look at all these missing victors! These are just some of the cases in this book. There must be hundreds of victors in here. They all went missing, carrying out orders from the captain. Holy crap, it's all a... It's a huge conspiracy. Look at the book! Victor Eleven found this old personnel roster that mentions hundreds of crew members missing. He was probably using the roster to try and find some leverage. But things turned ugly and the captain made him disappear. The roster conclusively points out the captain as the cause of the disappearances. The disappearances. The crew members were carrying out her orders when they disappeared. I believe she set up a meeting on the sun deck as a trap for Victor Eleven. 
that's the craziest thing I've ever heard. And people call me a nut job. I'm only trying to get to the bottom of the case. I think it would be best if we confronted the captain with what we know. This has gone too far. Don't bring me into your delusions, man, but I have proof. You probably forged the whole book just to get others overboard. You should put your skills to better use, bro. I'm not your bro. I'm gonna demand to see the captain. Then I'm gonna give her my just desserts. Ah, I don't wanna do that. Let's just talk to him. Whoops. I forgot. What? Did I put it on? Yes, okay. We're good. I'd like to... Ooh. It was Captain F, sir. What evidence do you have to back it up? Victor Eleven found old personnel files that mention hundreds of crew members. He was probably using the files to try and leverage some sort of deal. But things turned ugly and the captain made him disappear. The roster conclusively points out the captain as the cause of the disparate- Fucking hell, I've done it twice. The crew members were carrying out her orders when they disappeared. I believe she set up a meeting on the sun deck as a trap for Victor Eleven. Are you aware of what you're saying? Are you sure you're willing to bet your entire career on this? I'm only trying to get to the bottom of this case. I think it would be best if we confronted the captain. This has gone too far. That's very admirable, but I'm afraid I can't join you. The evidence is circumstantial at best. What? Also, I have other engagements. I think it's better if you confront the captain by yourself. It's probably best if you don't mention me. I wouldn't want to take credit for all your hard work after all. But go on ahead, call the bridge if you really want to push the issue. Okay, here we go. I need to speak to the captain. Captain Neff isn't here right now. I know the captain's behind the disappearances. The captain doesn't have time to listen to wild accusations. I can prove my claim. I have the personnel file she's been searching for. Well, dear boy, why didn't you say so? Come in. Let us talk about this. Here we go. I'm beginning to grow fucking hell. It's her and the, the tentacle. So this whole time it wasn't... Who was pushing the button then? Alicia, I finally found you. You can't believe what I had to go through in order to see you. Alicia isn't here right now. Would you like to leave a message? What? Who are you? I think you know who I am. Are you the machine in the basement? A crude description, but yes. I am part of the machine. What have you done to Alicia? Nothing really. She's still here. She's merely been... suppressed. I thought taking over her vocal faculties would make things easier. I thought it was Victor Neff this whole time. Make what easy? Fuck, they, they've merged. I swear if you've hurt her in any way... You can rest easy, Mr. Neff. Hurting a dreamer is only a last resort. Fuck. That was the last valuable thing Mr. Morton taught me. I want to extend the lease on life this family gave me. His family. 
but I can't allow you and your dupes to stand in my way. What happened to Victor Eleven? He got what he wanted. He got promoted to command. What have you done with the other missing crew members? I could tell you. But I think it would be more efficient to show you. Whoa, that's an interesting voice. Oh god, it's the root. He's been eating me! Pick up bone. I think my inventory's full. What's that horrible smell? Why am I walking? Oh god, what happened to my inventory? It's decreased rapidly. Uh, boop. Boop. Uh, no, probably want ventilation on. Wait, really? Oh, my. Ow! Ow! That was too loud. Look at all the corpses. This was Victor 84. His jaw is partly detached from the rest of his skull. Victor Eleven. The chute door is rusted shut. I can't open it. Use the bone. Nothing happened. Fuck. Examine the tentacle. It seems to be fucking... Fucking... <laughs> it seems to be fucking that roar... 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 roar, roar. My speech is fucking gone. I'm guessing this is another member of the crew, but it's hard to tell. I think this is uh, Victor 5. His face is almost unrecognizable, but judging by the badge, this is the bartender. This is where he ended up, the poor bastard. Oh god, he's still alive. He's... Want me to help you? Please. How can I help you? Help me. I'm sorry this happened to you. You brought this on yourself. I don't know how I can help you. I'll come back for you. Um. How? Club him to death? I can't bear to do that. Burn him! That's a good idea, but I don't think it'll be enough. Blood? He's not a vampire. I don't have enough alcohol to kill him. Wait. Gasoline. That, and that, and that! Shaker seems to be full. God dang it. No, I don't, I don't want to talk to him right now. Tentacles lodge itself in his stomach. How do I empty it? Where can I empty it? Shoot, it has to be open before I can do that. Molten corpse? Clear liquid is seeping from his ruptured eyes. Can I take some of it? The maimed corpse, the left arm is missing. Tendons are protruding from his sleeve. Uh, fresh corpse. The arms are covered in bite marks. Did he try to chew them off? Corpse. Corpse. Clothes have been ripped off, festering scratches, decomposed head, he's another member of the crew, corpse, another dead crew member, severed head, mangled corpse. It's the body of Victor Nine. His face seems to have been caved in due to blunt force trauma. Oh god, I had him killed, incidentally. Wait! 
is that if I switch this, I better not mess with it. Dang it! Uh, blood? I don't need to smear blood on it. Gas? Some of the rust came loose. Gas. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Come on! Yeah, I, I better throw this out and start over. I emptied the shaker. What do I want to make? Lemon juice. Gin. I don't have any more vermouth. Gasoline. Uh, guessing this is another member of the crew. I know this already. I know everything in this room, but there's nothing. Examine the rat poison. There's a label on it. There's a label on it? Did I read this label before? Ethanol, iron oxide, use is that. Can I put this in the shaker? No. Wait, wait! I think I know what I need to do. I just, hmm, how do I? Huh. <laughs> yes! Put some shards in the shaker. Put some rust in the shaker. Put some lemon in the shaker. Some gin and some gas. Turned into a makeshift rat poison. Give it to the bartender. Oh. Drink. Swallow this brother. That's all I can do for you now. These couple parts are gonna be the most haphazardly cut together pieces of shit ever. <laughs> it's gonna be like, I'm doing something, then a jump, because I just, I've been wasting way too much time. Something seems to be happening to the tentacle. Yeah, that's right, get the fuck out of her dream. Victor, are you there? Alicia? Thank God you're safe. Here, let me help you up. <laughs> I'd better climb the rope. I'm so sorry, Victor. I could see and hear you, but it's like I wasn't in control of my own body. I know, honey. The machine told me, but it's all right now. Aw, yeah, I could feel you in my dream. I wanted to warn you, but the machine wouldn't let me. I was so afraid it would hurt you. I know, honey. I managed to spoil its food supply. I don't think it'll come back anytime soon. No, but the machine is still forcing me asleep even though I'm fighting to wake you up. I thought you'd wake up once I severed it from your dream. Hmm, that's concerning. You need to cut the machine out of every dream first. Only then will it shut down completely and let me go. How do I get out of this dream? Leave the same place you came in. The exit to tri is tricky to spot if you don't know where to look. I'm sorry to leave you, but I have to. I'll see you soon, alright? Yeah, see you on the other side, my love. I don't know where to look. I know it was on the sun deck where I came up, though. Fuck's sakes, this music is so loud. There it is. 
Now that Alicia told me what to look for, the exit is actually easy to spot. Strange I couldn't see it before. Here we go! That took longer than I thought. But Alicia should be safe for now. She said I have to sever all tentacles before the machine will shut down. So now I have to enter my neighbor's dream somehow. But how can I access their apartments without them calling the police? Well, they should all be asleep too. And how do I make them fall asleep? Chapter 4. Get out as early as you can.